Hi everyone. In this video, I am going to show you how to use update and post step in Algodoo. These are two powerful tools that can be used to control the behavior of your objects. You can update the color, the density, the radius, the size or any other property of an object. The difference between the two is that update executes the code even when the simulation is not running. I mean the algudu is paused but the code is running. However, the code written in post step only runs when the simulation is running. As soon as you pause the simulation, the code stops executing. Let's begin. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Let's first change the color of the object using the update field. Type this code in the update field. You can see the color changes as soon as I hit the enter after typing the code. Now let's make a ruler in the rectangle. Just type this code in the update field and press enter. The ruler appears in the rectangle. Now let's make some text appear on the box. Type this code and here's the text appeared. Let's change the size of the object by this code. You see, the size has immediately changed. Now let's see if the update code runs even if it is paused. Let's pause the simulation. Type this code to change the color. You see, the color immediately changed even if the simulation is paused. Let's come to the second thing, the post step. Type this code to change the color. I pressed enter. But the color didn't change because the simulation is passed. Run the simulation. You see, color has changed now. Now let's try some amazing codes. Type this code to make an oscillating cake in the circle. You see, the cake is oscillating. Now remove math.sin. Look, now it has started spinning. To make a breathing circle, type this code. The radius will be regularly updating with the code. It looks like the circle is breathing. Now let's try some different kind of code. For this, you have to have a variable, for example, b. Type radius equals b. Now change the value of b. Again, change the value of b. You see, radius changed when the value of b is changed. Let's now update the density of the object by updating the value of the variable b. Type this code. Now change the value of b. You see the object flies because its density immediately decreased and it flew in the air. I hope you have learned and enjoyed this lesson. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.